Hey guys, my name is Seniak and welcome to what could potentially become a new series of Prison Architect where we now have the new DLC where we can build prisons on an island. I think the DLC is called Island Bound or something like that. Um, a lot has changed in this game since I last played it. Like, I opened it up to check out this new DLC and I seen the um, Paradox Interactive logo and I'm thinking that's the people who like either make City Skylines or the produ publishers of City Skylines. Now... I think own this or something like that. It's I, I don't even know what's going on, but this changes everything right now. This literally changed everything. The fact that you can now have an island where you build a prison on literally changes how you approach building a prison. Normally you have the road, they come to it. I don't know what happens if a prisoner comes on an island. Can they still escape? What do they do? Do they swim? We're gonna find out all of these these answers to many questions and again guys if you want me to turn this into a series where we build pretty much our very own version of Alcatraz let me know by smashing that like button down below leave a comment saying send you full play some more and we'll do just that but I am quite excited to build my own freaking prison on an island so before we jump straight into this then um, I kind of need to make sure that we close the prison so nobody comes in I got a few different stuff kind of enabled I have gangs enabled, I have uh, reputations enabled so they can get better or worse for the prisoners depending on what they do on the island. Uh, I have weather conditions enabled so we can gonna get snowy, we have to make sure we do all the heating. I have staff needs enabled as well so I'm trying to make it as difficult as possible. So this should be a lot of fun. So we have a little boat right now bringing in all of our goods that we need uh, to build our prison. Our little beautiful little supply boat so I suppose then we're gonna pause it for a minute for a hot second and do some planning so we need to accept our first grant so accept our first grant which I always forget where they are it's in our reports over here grants and uh, we have a lot of the mods installed from what I originally had set up in one of our previous um, series that we did on it but we'll keep it quite basic and quite simple to begin with. So we're going to start our first contract here by building a basic detention center. So that is going to help us out uh, heavily with trying to earn some sweet, sweet monies in the pro process. So we're going to... Um, hold it. Can I make this a little bit bigger for me? Hold on. What's it within the options? Uh, graphics, uh, resolutions on auto. That's fine. Is there nothing that we can make the UI a little bit bigger? Game version 2.0 GUI. I mean, that's pretty much as it is. I don't think you can. Can you? So, da, 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 no, I'm gonna say no, but it's okay. Get out of here, boy. So, pause them and let's start some planning. So, we need a holding cell in the shower and all that kind of jazz. Let's kind of get that up and running first. And so, I've got this whole island to build on. I don't know where to fully start, which is quite exciting. I've never had. Uh, normally you just get this blank area and you're kind of building everything by squares but we'll try our best and do something a little bit different so if I pick a spot to work with where we'll be for example let's build a yard and then we base the whole prison around that yard so if I kind of go here and we'll do a a 30 by 25 is that big enough for a yard or do I go a 30 well 25 by 40 Right, there we go. And that will be the yard of the whole entire prison. So based off that then, we build the prison around it. So we start with some pathways then. And I'm thinking we do either a two wide or a four wide. What are we thinking? Well, I can even do a three wide. Do you know what? Yeah, we'll do a three wide path going around. And I think I'll make all the corridors three wide as well. It just be, you know, it just kind of gives it a little bit extra room for people to maneuver around the prison. So free wide going around. That is the pathway it kind of goes around it, and then we'll do the walls to kind of fit around that. So I know where the corridor walkway is before they go outside to the yard. This is exciting, isn't it? It really is. Okay, 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 okay. So if I Kill off that bit there and kill off this bit here as the corridor then, oh hold on, extends in either direction. I think we'll build a couple of cells up on this point to begin with. Or should we build it over here? I've got so many options I can go with. Hmm. 
<laughs> I mean, we're going to build cells all over the place, but I think, you know what, to begin with, we'll build them just here. Yeah. So I could quick build a cell, a basic cell, and you can see right now it is a 4 by 5 So if I stuck it there, that's where it would go, a 4 by 5 And I've gone down by 40, haven't I? So I should be able to get 10 cells going down in a row. So I know I don't have the Faraday's engine just yet, but... This costs me a couple of pennies to begin with. So that's free. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, the one thing I didn't take into, into consideration is you kind of lose one by doing that. So if that went there, that would then go there, that would then go there, and that's perfect. So that's ten, eleven, twelve. 13. So we're getting 13 going down the whole thing like that. Which is actually quite a lot, isn't it? So 13, if we split the difference and got rid of one and had 6 either sides, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This one here, right, how do I get rid of that one? Just like that. 6 either side. So you get like a little split little walkway through the middle. Damn, that's a lot of cells straight away, isn't it? So that costs us a fair few smackaroonies there, a fair few dolliers. But that is enough right now. And what we'll quickly do as well, we'll get the quick build back up again with our basic cell. And we'll go with a, so again, a three wide gap. So that's two, three. Now if I just pull it either end, so one, two, three. Just so I know where the walls or where the edge of that stuff is. So if I go for that brick wall... But then again, I've got to... Do you know what? I need to actually do the foundations. How expensive is it going to be for foundations? That is probably going to be the next thing, isn't it? So 420 there. How much for these? Only 5 Gs there. Holy smokes. And just there as well. All right, we'll see what happens to that then. We'll see what happens. So we're not getting any prisoners coming in anytime soon yet because we've closed the intake. So we might as well let our workers... Just finish all of this up. Now, it's probably worth me hiring a few extra workers, right? One, two. So two extra workers there. We've got ten now in total to get some of this work done. So we've got 12. We've got 14 potential cells to begin with. Which I think will be enough, right? It'll be enough to, to kind of start with. Well, we hope so. <laughs> we hope so. So go down. There is a lot of stuff to get done. We've got to chop down trees, get the foundations down. Oh, I'm missing this bit as well. Just realised. The foundation's just here. For that little section. And I think for now as well, we'll just leave it to a block. Eventually we'll have it all incorporated with its own little system and tunnels and... Not tunnels, corridors. <laughs> not, don't say tunnels in this game. Tunnels are quite bad. Very bad. Um... Right, okay, so objects then. Let's go back to normal play mode. I need, or oh, I want to get down some jail doors. Now, where are the jail doors? Did they, oh, walls and doors. They're in their own little section. So, barbed wall, no, no, I want doors. Can I go for, like, oh, oh, wow, we got loads of different options, haven't we? We got a large jail door there. We can have a large jail door, grey, jail door, or what's the difference between a large and a grey? I don't. 100% no. Um, should I just go for a large? I mean, eventually I probably... Oh. Do you know what? This is probably where, you, where you, I need to just go over by one more to make it a little bit more even. So I'll add one just there so they can get in. But I think what I'll do is pause quickly right now. Objects. Are they placed on the objects? Yeah. We'll dump that there. How far did I get with all this? Ah, okay. And we'll demolish this. This is why you need to do some, like, you know, you need to kind of set all this up. Let's demolish these walls. Alright, get rid of you. Dump that door. I mean, expand the foundations by one more. That's literally all we're going to do. Just so I can get that perfect four wide corridor for the double door system. That's literally what I want it to do. So let the workers finish that up then. They'll get all the little furniture in, the tables and the tables and chairs, the beds, the toilets. Where do they get tables and chairs from? 
No idea. No idea right now. Um, but also I've just noticed as well, it's a different style of wall that we've got in. Actually, with that in, I don't, I, I've got 10 in. I don't need to go any further, do I? So I think I'll just leave it to that then. There's no point me dropping that in just yet. So let me finish up then. We do need to get some pipes in for the utilities. So a large pipe. Uh, we'll push directly up here. And we'll get the small pipes in for each of the toilets. Oh, there's not one there. Cancel. I forget that's the walkway. There we go. Back to the, the, the doors then. Uh, the large jail door. There's the gap there. We'll throw it in. Sweet, 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 sweet. Currently have two entry points at the moment. We'll have the third one down there, but again, don't want to go too crazy. Now, if I got, they're, already, they're already designated to cells, which is good. So wait for a little bit of daytime to come through. We've got the pipes in, so we just need that utility room eventually. So rooms... Um, is it not flooring? See, this, I, I, I'm losing where some of this stuff is because I haven't played this game. Uh, with the new updates recently. Get the yard in. So there's the yard. Which is pretty handy. We need to get the showers in. Which I think we'll start by um, designing some showers over on this side. So walls. Um, we'll bring it out by 10. If I do a 10 by 10, or I can go for the full distance. That's a 19. So is that also a 19 by 10? Um, yeah. So it means I could build potentially there two additional rooms in. Now, I could go with a shower room on the one side and like a common room on the other. Which would be pretty good, pretty handy. So I think we'll start with that. And how expensive are we going to be to lay foundations here? So going directly up. Oh, it's going to cost us a pretty penny. But that will be kind of handy as well. And we'll then plan our canteen. So here are the walls then. And we'll do a nice little... That's 23 across. If I went 23 by 23, or do I go up a little bit more? If I stick it to just there... Four, is that 14 across, really? Yeah. So 14 by... 30. How is that for a canteen slash kitchen area? Shouldn't be too shabby. And we'll set up the kitchen here at the back then. So we'll come down by 7. And then we'll lay the foundations just there as well. There we go. And then might as well just get that connected there. What will be our little corridor hallway. Oh, missing that bit as well. I'm forgetting it's free wide. <laughs> you already forgot straight away. It's free wide in the main corridor system. So fast forward now then. Let them get that work done. Because again, there is still then a lot more to come. A lot more that we need to add in. So we do a common room in one of them. We do the shower block in the other. Which would provide us with lots of showers. Done the yard there. Got to do the kitchen, the canteen. And we just got to do all the finishing little touches to kind of finalise our little prison before we can start accepting the peeps in. And then we pretty much just go from there. So the guards are working super duper fast right now. Doing an amazing job. And that is then all done, boys. Well, it should be all done. Is there any last little finishing touches they need to do? Nope, not really. Nice. Um, right, so. Walls and doors and stuff like that. And I'm not going to get any doors just here. Walls. We'll go brick straight across there. Straight across there. Straight across there for the showers. Now, doors-wise, do you know what? I don't think I'm going to put a door in these rooms. I think we'll leave them quite open. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, bam, 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 bam. Actually, we'll go four wide on the entry points. 
Because for the showers, you can put down the drains to, um... Whatchamacallit, to stop the water flowing out. I was trying to think then what, what, what I was trying to say. <laughs> right, piping going... We'll just sort the piping out right now. We sort the electrical cables out. Going all the way around. That should be enough there for all those rooms. We'll get the electric cables going up here as well. There's across there. And the pipes there, we'll get that in. That'll be enough there to keep our builders busy again. Right, sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, that's now all in there. So let's focus on the... We'll turn this one here into the shower room. So rooms... Uh, we need it to be the shower. Try that in straight away. And... Uh, do I... Do I... Do I push it? We have white tiles. How much would white tiles be to, to do that? Oh, okay. Not as expensive as I thought it would be. There we go. Uh, objects then. We get the drains that just... Oh, that's not the one I want. Drains that just kind of go there to stop the water flooding out. And then shower heads. So if I do it like this... For now... Get the shower heads in. Until, you know, we have a better system or whatnot. So again, keep it quite basic. I'll do the common room like an, like at some point in the future. The room's there anyway, ready for it. And then we obviously we have the room there to do more cells on the opposite side. But it is quite expensive to get all that in. So then i got to start thinking about the canteen. So I'm now down to 20 Gs. But is there any other grants I can quickly take to help me the money? So installing the mods gives me a grant, which we'll take. Um, cell block here, raise capacity to 15. Uh, no, I won't do that. Is there, isn't there one for the canteen? I'm sure there's one for the canteen. Administration center there. Health and well-being. I know it's this one, this rolls it as well, but I just wondering if there's like another one. Um, pumping station, drains, shower heads. Oh, that will be handy. Because we can make some progress with that. Because that was also doing with the, um, the shower just there. Um, right, let me quickly get set up then with the walls. Brick walls here. Straight across. Get rid of... Oh. There we go. Uh, Door-wise, we just want... We'll just do normal doors. Because eventually we can hire the prisoners to work in the kitchen. And if we just set up the rooms right now. So this would be the canteen. We'll have the kitchen just up here. And we won't put a door in it just... Oh, I keep, I keep doing that. We won't put a door in it just yet. Because we're just making free flow through it. So a lot of work for our workers now to get, to get done. A lot of it is down to the piping and the electrical grid. Which they'll squeeze all that in. So while they're doing that, we've got to think about the entry into our prison. So put the planning back down again. And if I went to about here, and then created a 5x5, five 5x5, five, five by five, And that will be our reception room that brings them in. Right. Okay, okay, okay. So that's the reception room just there. And I think just here we'll set up some utility stations. So can I quick build those? Uh, utility room. There we go. Oh, it's huge. It's a big room. And, oh, I can't squeeze it in quite there. It's a little bit too oddly shaped to place here, unless I stick it out by one more, the planning. But again, the water doesn't allow me to do it. So I could place down the little substation just up here, or I could build my own room, to be honest with you. So in terms of planning here, if I went with... Can I get away with that? Utilities. How big is the pumping station? No, I need one more. All right, we got you boys. We got you. Just there. So foundations. 
just there. Right, we're getting somewhere. So once them little stations are in, we can then start having the water and the power out, and we'll bring the whole place to light them. Let me get everything up and running. Still got 25,000 in the bank right now. We completed that um, grant with the shower system. So what can now replace it then? So let's see. Metal detectors, bookworm. That could be to do with the common room. That oh, it doesn't really give you too much. Phone booths, visitation, staff room. Administration block there. We'll get that on the go as well. Because that's something else that we got to do. Some offices and whatnot. So here is the entry point then for the prison. So walls and doors again. Large jail door. We'll have two entry points for that. Um, staff door in the utility room just here. Or staff door. Walls. We'll demolish these walls here. Because we don't need... Oh, wait. Is there even a gap? Yeah, there is. We've got a mixture right now of concrete walls and brick walls, which I find hilarious. Uh, that's now all in. So back into play. Utilities. So we set up our little power station just there. And we set up our water pumping station just here. We'll drop... A couple of capacitors for now for it. Let me just kind of go around the borders here. Straight into there, straight to there. Water pipes will bring straight out, straight down. And that should be all we need for the utilities. And then we're up and running with those, which is pretty sweet. Right, I'm quite excited. I am quite excited. So, we do need some more ways in which we have safety. Like, they can't escape. So, that will be down to... Um, right, we have visitor doors. Bamboo door. <laughs> what are we going to use a bamboo door for? Bamboo do for? <laughs> I, don't, I can't even English. Uh, visitor doors. Okay. Jow doors in red. Ooh, fancy. Fence gates. Right, jail door just here. And then we'll set up some walls as well. Either side just there before they enter into the prison. So there's two doors that kind of stop them coming in and out. Um, right, that's all set up then. We should get the war and power very soon once they finish off the utilities. So getting fast forwarded with that then. I'm quite excited, guys. We, we, we've, we've, we're slowly getting there. We are slowly getting there. 29,000 left in the bank right now. There we go. The power has been turned on. Now, are we missing some lights? I feel like we slightly are. There's a few little places where we have lights that are trapped within walls. So dump that one. Dump that one. Dump that one. Uh, objects, lights. Get a couple of lights down here. There you go. This just, just provides just something a little bit extra. Right, not bad. So, we've got all that set up then. Uh, oh, we don't have water in here. Um, gonna get some pipes down there. Right there. So, we okay, we've got that. So, we've got the shower done. We've got a couple of cells done right now. We don't have a holding cell just yet. But we will get that set up very soon. Uh, we don't have the kitchen and canteen finalised. Oh, that's a shower. How do I, how have I just realised that is a shower? Canteen, kitchen. There we go. So, for the kitchen then... We're going to need a couple of cookers. So I'll do one, two, three, four, five, six cookers there. Just so we're on the safe side. A few refrigerators right now to store the food. We need a sink for the mess. And we need a bin. 
and sprinklers. The lazarus will be water in case of a fire. Yeah, that will probably come in handy. I'll do one there, one there. And can I, is it handy to have a table in here as well? Table small. There we go. So they can store stuff on if they need to. Uh, now, for the canteen, where's the serving tables? One there. Okay, so we can fit in two. Then for the table, let's start at the very bottom for these. So we'll have one there, one there. So I just want to see what the spacing's like. Oh, okay, we can fit it like that. That's quite cool. And it's got to go on that side. For the benches to have space. So it's more than we currently need at this moment in time. But as we grow the prison, we'll then have more needs. But I'm hoping then for the small table, yeah, we can fit a load of small ones going up in the center, which would be quite cool. And that should finalize the canteen and kitchen to a certain extent. I might have to do a bit of electricity or plumbing. I think I might need to do the plumbing when it comes to that kitchen sink. So let me uh, just quickly get that done then. So electrics down just to there. Plumbing down to here. There we go. We're going to be up and running uh, for that. What are we missing here? Oh, the serving table. Oh, yeah, they're not in just yet. They're not currently in just yet. The last few boxes coming in. There we go. That finishes that up. Do some electric grids. And we're pretty much good to go. Uh, we just need a holding cell. Right now. So we'll build that. But we also need to build the offices as well. So back into play mode. Let's get the planning set up for that then. So this is going across by 8. And if I had a... Two wide corridor just coming off. What we're going to do here, build a holding cell. Now, do we have a quick build for a holding cell? Uh, we do. But I feel like I should build it myself. Um, right, walls. Holding cell at 10 by 10. We'll go with that. Foundations then. Set that up, boy. It's a nice little holding cell there. And then we'll add the offices in a little bit further up. So we'll just finalize this. I also need to probably build a wall around the yard. So what we'll do then, build in, uh, no, I need walls. Uh, brick wall here, it's a little bit cheaper. Build that going around. Now all this is, the, the path around here is gonna be classes outside as well, just kind of give it a little bit more of a nice vibe. And then we'll probably build like a little fence so far around. Or a hedge. Or oh, a hedge would be nice, wouldn't it? Should we build a hedge around it? Or is that too fancy? Hmm. Uh, flooring, concrete tiles. Which is the outdoor ones? Oh, it's the tiles, yeah, not the floor. Right, get this down as well. So it will slowly start to get rid of some of the trees that won't be able to be placed down. And we got 10,000 left at the minute. Right, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So walls, brick wall. Let's get that these grants done. Right, getting all that down now. I should really set up the exports. So can I do the exports one? Uh, rooms, where's exports? There we go. Export some of that wood that we chopped down. That'd be a way to make a little bit of cash back. Uh, doors. We need a large jail, jail door. We'll pull it just there. There we go. We get some money back for those logs, which will help us out with uh, building. The yard's now in. So it's just the holding cell that we're now missing out on. So let's zone this room. Holding cell. There we go. And let's get what's needed inside of that holding cell. 
So we need the basics and we need a toilet. Now I place the toilet. We'll place it up here. We'll do. I'll do two toilets. We'll do a bench. We'll get some bunk beds in here. There we go. What else could we do with? Uh, oh, it's just a bench. Got some beds in there because it helps them out. Get some phone booths. And let's get a small bench in. We get two smaller benches in. And I just want to finish up the toilet little area here. With a little brick, bit of a brick wall going around it. And... Let's throw a door on there. So at least they've got a uh, they, they can have they can go to the toilet in privacy, even if it is two by two. You know what I mean? There's a little bit of privacy thrown in. And then let's just sort the plumbing out real quick. Then that's all done, and all I'm really missing then is hiring two guards and two chefs to complete that basic detention center. So, that as far as it is right now, that's kind of all we need, right? Oh, sprinklers. Sprinklers need water. Yeah, but that's all we kind of need to open it up. I'm just then missing the, the water and stuff over here, which we can get done. But we do have 15,000 in the bank right now. So back into play mode then. Let's get the staff set up then. So two cooks. There we go. Two guards. There we go. That grant is then completed. So what would be on the next on the list? A staff room. Uh, at least five phone booths in your prison. Yes, yeah, that is quite a big stack of money to get done. So where's the phone booths? Uh, there. So we've already got two in over here. We'll get two in here for the what will be our reception room. And I think we'll set up two. We'll set up a couple like around here. Like this will be our well this is going to be our yard area. So set up three there. We are going to have a little common room over here. Set up free there. And uh, once they build those, that will complete that grant. We need to think about the offices then. So do we have the option to quick build offices? Uh, office, yes we do. So if I went one there, that will end there and place that there. Right, okay, so if I drop an office here and here, I can do then one there and there. Foundations in real quick. There we go to finish that up. Nice. Again, lots more work getting done. We won't pull in any of the guards just yet. Uh, guards, sorry, prisoners just yet. Because there still is a fair, fair few things I want to get done. Oh, I've just realised... We have an entrance there. We should have an entrance here. So objects. Um, do you know what? Actually, we'll... Oh, do I want to get rid of the... The walls? We'll put a door on it. I feel like we should put a door on it. So normal jail door there. We've gone for a grey one there. Why not? We'll just throw in there. So we have... The two places set up there as the entry points. We've already built one of the offices. Just waiting for them to finalise the last couple now. And we need the utilities up here as well. See, we're slowly making the progress, boys. Slowly but surely we're making progress. So that'll be done. We just need to hire the warden. There we go. Hire and then, well, unlock it through bureaucracy here, the accountant. Um, which is... Where's the accountant, boy? 
I'm, at, I'm looking for the, the word accountant. I'm gonna unlock the finance. Damn fool. You damn fool, you. So what other grants do we have? So we have a lot of modded ones. But not all the mod ones are installed, if that makes sense. We've gone a little bit easy on it. Um, staff room is probably next, but it's a fairly low one. But it's something that we're going to have to also take care of. So, play. So, I think... Yeah, we're going to have to set up a staff room because it's something that is going to be needed within the prism. So, let's do some planning for that then. So we can take it to there, which is 11, but I think we'll take it to the 10. And we'll do a nice little 10 by 10 room. So I think this will be the last thing that I build before we go, you know what? We're ready for the prisoners. We're ready for the prisoners at this point. Which I'm excited about. So let's get this staff room up and running. Last few things in. And I think it's all pretty much locked off. I don't know whether they can swim. If anybody can let me know, because I don't really want to test it out, because I don't want to lose <laughs> any, uh, any 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 prisoners on my island. But I bet you by the time I'm ready to open up the prison, winter's coming. And then I'm going to have to do all the heat and stuff. So that should be all done. Oh, they came close. So close. Right, rooms. What else can I uh, designate then? So reception, which is this room, we're going to get done. Staff room, which will designate just here. Walls and floors, finish that up there and there. Doors, we want the staff room door just there. And then objects for the staff room. Uh, let's just do the, the basics of first. Wide sofa, why is my the thingy? So three wide sofas, one drinks machine. So three wide sofas, uh, one drink machine. We'll place down the small. Do I do the small table? Because they need. And I don't know if it's a room. No, but they they also have they they also eat. So you also need to provide them with food and stuff. It's a shame you can't do like a smaller servant table. But I'll place this just there. To then have the small bench and table. There. And I think we'll keep it to that. That's probably as much as we're going to need for the most part. So let them get on with that. Um, so that will enable me. Once we've built the drinks machine, that will enable the staff room to be completed. What I need to do now is hire an accountant. There we go for a thousand. That's completed that grant. And I think we're pretty much ready to go. We just gotta then accept in some prisoners. But we might as well finish this bit off as well. So this is the um, reception area. A table. We'll place there. Uh, that's where they get change and whatnot. I need, what do I need again? A table, office desk and a chair. So, how should I do this? How should I attempt this? I think what we'll do, place that there. Uh, where's my chair here? And we'll play build the wall just there. Where's doors for the staff door just there? As that watches the peeps go in, the prisoners. It's quite a cool little area. It is going to be quite a cool little area. So, completing all the grants right now. We're pretty much all good to go. So, I think we're, we're ready. We're ready. We'll only accept the capacity uh, of 12. Damn, we can accept 12 people. That's crazy to think that as well. Um, So, should we do it? I think we should do it, right? Yeah. Oh, no, wrong place. I'm going to the wrong place. What am I doing? It's down here. So, intake will always fill capacity. I mean, except a little bit of a minimum and medium. There we go. I wonder if any of them is going to be gang members. That's going to be kind of interesting to find out. Uh, for a next grant, then, to take a look at, 
cell block 15 uh, doctor's visitation no I want the one that does the common room which one's that that's metal detectors walls of eyes visitation bookworm it's this one here the bookworm one that'll be handy for the visitation room so we'll get that set up in just a just a second in just a moment uh, prisoners are coming in 13 hours, so I've still got a little bit of time to play around with. We might as well just get that set up now then. So, or we also have to do the regime as well, sort that out. So, common room. There we go. And let's place some common room stuff. So, all at the minute, all we need is bookshelves for it to be classed as that being done. Where's my bookshelves? That's a bookcase. Where's the bookshelves? Am I blind? Bookshelf. That's what I need at the minute, so... I need three of them as well. So if I place these at the bottom... There we go. We'll, uh... Drop in some... I'll go for a large bench. And a large table. Oh my god, it's me. Large table there so they can sit down and chill out. We'll place in... Um, I, I'm, there we go, snack machine. They might enjoy that. I'll drop in two snack machines there. I place in a little TV here, and we do a couple of little sofas. There we go. Shoot, little armchair sofas as well, so they can gather around a TV. Um, I could have done a large one as well, to be honest with you. We'll do. We'll place in a radio just over here, and I think that's as far as I'm going to go with the common room for now. So we're spending money thick and fast. Fast forward then. Get that common room done, which that grant is now completed. So what else can I benefit from before I bring my first set of prisoners in? In in 10 hours at the minute. So let me see. What, can I do anything that's going to revolve around a grant? Maintenance. Oh, what did I click that for? Let me get rid of that. Cancel that. Uh, is there a yard one? Um... Reform, that's education stuff, smelly snacks. Uh, that'll be a good one to get done, the maintenance side of things. So, bureaucracy. Uh, maintenance is just here. So, I've got a lot of grounds keeping and then get some cleaners and some gardeners up and running. But also get at least four weight benches done as well. That'll be handy for the yard. So, where's the weight benches? There's all the, there's a bunch of different stuff we can get done for, like their very own little gym. Place out some weight benches, stack of tires. We do a little yard system, couldn't we? They're fairly cheap. Those are the dumbbell racks. Can't place that in there because there's freaking trees in the way. Uh, some tire apparatus. We can watch them do all their moves. And punch bag. So we've got a nice little gym system here for them at the minute. That's actually quite cool. Floodlights. I wonder what that's going to be like, a floodlight. We'll see, but I've now literally spent all my money, so... It is what it is at this point right now. But at least i got some stuff in the yard that they can de-stress with. And now it's just all about waiting for the cash money moolah to roll in. So the staff's got some food in there already. That's good to see that the, the cooks are doing what they need to do. 
Um, we need oh we need at least four weight benches. <laughs> I only got two in oh three in sorry. So there's still one more to go on that front. And now we just play the waiting game. So we're waiting now another four hours before they start coming in. But this is not bad. Oh, we got a grant completion there. All right, play mode. Um, objects. Let me just get that additional weight mention. There we go. Can I squeeze anything else here? I like the uh, floodlights. They do. They do a pretty good job. Uh, benches. That might be handy. Getting a couple of benches thrown into the yard. They're fairly cheap. And a training dummy. What is all? What are we training them to do? We're training to become like ninja warriors, aren't we? Right. Okay. Go. Let's get stuff done. So my island is pretty good. It's pretty good for the most part. I'm happy with how it's currently turned out. With how basic it currently is. So that's quite exciting. Prisoners are now going to finally arrive on the island. And I'll be quite excited to see how they do approach it. How they come in. It's going to be by boat. I get that. But I've only got two guards at the moment. So maybe I hire a few extra guards. Insufficient funds. Okay, I don't have enough funds yet. But I'm hoping we get like some money for the prisoners coming in. So here are the prisoners right now. Yep, yeah, we got a, a nice little stack of change. Well, I've just hired two more chefs. I don't know why. Okay, we've now got ten guards on the whole place. And while they're checking these guys in, can I sort out the regime? Yes, I can. So let's say they wake up at... Um, at six, like they do. They wake up, can I get rid of that, and they shower. Two hours to shower, fine. Two hours to eat, good. And then they can do, they can have some free time for quite some time there, which will then lead into lock up for two hours. Then they can come out and eat. Then they can have some yard time. Yeah, yard time. Then an hour to shower. <laughs> then we lock them back up again. Actually, let me let me re, re, you know reverse this by one, so I can get a two-hour shower gap in. Then lock up for an hour. So hopefully that will keep them sweet. Hopefully that will keep them sweet. Then so we got the prisoners coming in. We're finding some stuff on them already as they do the checks and whatnot. Uh, I'm not sure if ten guards is going to be enough at this point. We'll get this pushing through. There's one dude here being left currently. What's going on with him? He doesn't... Requires, oh, requires solitary confinement. Ah! Yeah, because they've already found some goods on him, so he, he kind of does need to be punished straight away. I don't have any solitary confinement right now. I knew there was going to be something. I knew there was going to be something. So out of my prisoners... Right now, none of them have any gang symbols on their face. Uh, let me just lock a couple of this open. So lock open. Lock open. Uh, lock open. Just some of the main parts. That we just wanted to kind of nicely flow through. Now, yeah, that's the point. Yeah, we don't have any solitary confinement yet, do we? So we're going to have to add some of that in. And I think I might... For now, just use something here until I can set something up. So quick build some solitary confinement. Oh, I don't have enough money. I don't have enough cash just yet. That's fine. So the regime at the minute is free time. And for the most part, they just want to chill in their own cell. That's what they want to do. That's what they want to do right now. But we're starting to cook up. Getting their dinner already. And how much are you going to cost me to build a uh, solitary cell? Does it say? No, it doesn't really say, does it? 
Which is a shame, really, because I could have done with that. Right, eat time right now. The prisoners are now eating. Still can't afford to build it just yet. That's fine. Uh, do we have the needs yet? We don't have. We haven't got like a lot of the psychologists to get the needs. But this is the yard time. I only am going to use any of my equipment that I spent so much money freaking on right now. I don't think they're at that stage just yet. They're all over the place because they've only just come into the prison. But yeah. Um, right. Need that solitary cell, man. We're getting close to being able to build it, though. They all come in here. Nobody wants to do anything because they don't quite... Don't quite have those needs. But they can shower, but they don't want to. And then to sleep, they will go. Well, after lockdown. <laughs> right, lost some more money. I think what we'll do... Objects. Where's my dismantle objects button? Or oh, sell objects. Can I sell? Or dismantle? A few trees. That helped me with um, getting some money together because we can export the wood for the most part right now. Get that out of here. Get some more money coming together. And we can build that solitary cell because that dude is going to get angrier and angrier and that's just no good for anybody. So we've got to wait for a boat to arrive to get rid of that wood. So off it goes. We get a little bit of chunk of change from it. And then get ready to build our solitary cell. Again, I'm just going to build it for here for now. Or should I build it there? They're all showering. Um... Right, I, bu I build it this side. No, I build it here. Build it there for now. Gonna need the utilities. Real quick. To get that toilet set up. Get them finalised with all the rest of it. What are they now waiting for? Aha, here comes all the brickwork right now. Is that now all done? Yep. Oh, the dude going angry right now. Well, let me just get rid of all my planning. There we go. We can see a bit better. That dude's going angry right now. Are they going to sort him out? Yeah, you're going to get the beat down, boys. He's going to get the beat down. Oh, the guard's hurt. Oh, the guard's taking a beating. The prisoner's now going to take a beating. We've had an injured guard. He's now unconscious. How dare he try and take them on? Is that designated to a solitary, by the way? Uh, solitary, solitary, where are you? Yeah, it is. He just got the beat down, boys. This is what we now need doctors. Because <laughs> people are already fighting. It's not great, is it? It really isn't. Damn. Um, but can we now unlock... We can unlock the groundskeeping at some point. Or the, the cleaning. Can't afford either. Uh, micromanagement unlocks food logistics. Now you specify kitchens. All that kind of jazz. We need the psychologist to understand their needs. So see if we can get that done. So here's we're going to probably just die. Because nobody wants to look after him because we don't have any doctors yet. We haven't got that set up. Which is a shame, to be honest with you. It really is. <laughs> uh, I just can't afford it yet. That's the, that's the issue. I just cannot afford it yet. Right, have they done the bureaucracy yet? No. How f we might as well get it unlocked so we can ha can hire a doctor, and the doctor can just then float about until we can set up a ward and, and stuff. Right, they're now over here. Will they use anything? Will they chill out? So a couple of benches, just chilling like strawberry villains. Uh, we've really now unlocked the psychologist, which we 
can't quite afford still at this point. We just need another like fifty-five dollars, and then we can find out all of their like moods and stuff, and then what they need and whatever. So I don't think they need that additional shower uh, on their regime. Where's their regime right now? So that additional shower there. Maybe I just let it to set it to free time at the end. Because they can share if they want to in their free time. It's entirely up to them. Right, come on. $25 away. Oh, okay. We ain't doing it now, are we? Of course we ain't. Do I get rid of it a little bit more of this jungle? And there's, there's more jungles around. Get rid of the trees because, you know, it's free money to us. It is free money. Right, so no issues just yet. Issues will arise as time goes on. We probably need to build more, uh, whatchamacallit, solitary cells at some point. But we'll have like a, a properly dedicated area to it. Gotta get a cleaner because our jail is dirty right now. It's t shocking. That's what it is, shocking. We've run on like, the health side of things, so we can uh, improve the health and revitalize our prisoners and our guards. Right, off goes that, ships that out. Staff, we've got our psychologist there. We'll hire one doctor, because we can afford to. We'll go around now and start healing peeps. Uh, which means we've now unlocked the needs. Which you can now see the needs in. So they need recreation more than anything. Which is uh, stuff to pass the time at the common areas. Which they do have a common area. Like, go and enjoy it. Which there's some of them are doing right now. They need to watch a little bit of telly. Telly's facing the right way, so I don't know what their problem is. Unless I replace the telly for the big one. So objects. If I sell... Oh, dismantle. There we go. And replace it with the large TV. I can get two in. Well, not really. I can maybe just move them here instead. So at least they're in line with the sofas. They're fighting right now. Are the guards going to... Oh, there's one death. Holy smokes. We have a death already. That's not good. <laughs> that really is not good. But we'll get the groundskeeping underway. It requires a foreman to get that done. Which a foreman comes from maintenance, which we should have the ability to hire one. Yeah. £1,000 for a foreman there. That completes and fills up the four offices that we've built. So groundskeeping get unlocked. We can then hire a gardener. We'll work on getting a cleaner as well to clean up this place. Because it ain't too great. But this could be a beautiful little prison, boys. This really could be. Really could be. I think we're going to end it for here then, guys. I hope you did enjoy this episode. Like I said, if you want to see more of it turn into a series, then please make sure you smash that like button down below. Uh, make sure you subscribe if you haven't already so you know when the next episode comes out. And until next time, guys, I'll see you all soon. So, good. Bye -bye.